New at 9 legislation that came out of tragedy and heartache is moving forward at the state capitol. The Senate bill focus on, focuses on changing custody and visitation rights. It's inspired by the deaths of these three kids in a murder-suicide in Vertigris last year at the hands of their own mom during a supervised visit. Fox 23's Alex Cash has been following this and is live after speaking with the two dads who hope this bill will save more lives in the future. As you say, I spoke with the dads earlier on. They're calling this the Three Angels Bill. And they say this is bittersweet for them. The bill is one step closer, but it comes at the cost of their children. This video shows Billy Jacobson and Ryan McGee in the Senate chamber as the bill, inspired by the deaths of their children, passed the full Senate. And we stood up and just, it was so welcoming and so genuine. To see all the senators stand up and look at us, some of them wave at us because they knew us and uh, support us the way they were. It was just totally overwhelming. Investigators say last July, Brandy McCaslin killed nine-month-old Billy, five-year-old Bryce and Noe, who was 11, before turning a gun on herself during a supervised visit. Billy and Noe's dad are behind Senate Bill 1756 that they hope will change the way those visits are held. Jacobson and McGee told me McCaslin had attempted suicide before and was still allowed supervised visitation. The bill says anyone who's supervising a visit needs to be trained and that there should be a mental health evaluation for custody or visitation if a court has ordered it. To make it where... There's nobody having to sit at home like we were, and it felt like, like in the movie Back to the Future, where you could watch their picture fade away. It's what it felt like in real life. It was like you knew every day that something could possibly happen, and Brandy was getting worse and worse. I spoke with the dads as McGee, wearing his daughter's name on a chain around his neck, told me they hope the bill becomes law. To save lives and for... Uh, our kids leave a legacy in their little lives. I think in the end, it, it's we're going to leave this world a better place than it is when we got here. And our kids will have done that too. And I think that's all we can ask for. Now that it's passed the Senate, it will go over to the House. If it passes there, it will go to the governor's desk. Live covering news that matters, I'm Alex Cash, Fox 23 News. If signed, this legislation will take effect November 1st. Trust Fox 23 to track the progress of this legislation and keep you updated.